You are very welcome. Good evening for everybody. This is the 11th annual Union City Festival, Theater Festival in the park. This happens the old Thursdays in the outside park, but today we have an special event. That's what, that is the reason why we are here inside of the, of the Musto uh, Cultural Center. This is an event is in behalf of the Mayor Brian P. Stack and the Board of the Commissioners. Then, right now, I introduce with you uh, Susan Chairman and the Robert Lawrence Trio. Then, Susan, please. Thank you, Peter, very much. Uh, we are very grateful to be here tonight at this 11th annual Union City Theater Festival in the park, which was moved to the William Musto Center uh, due to rain. Uh, we'd like to thank Ma uh, Mayor and Senator Brian P. Stack for inviting us here tonight, along with Lucio Fernandez, the Commissioner of Public Events, especially Megan Fernandez, who is the Artistic Director of the Grace Theater Workshop that provides free dance lessons for children of all ages here in Union City. Uh, please support her program because the, the dance lessons are free and it teaches the children stamina and good coordination and focus and a whole list of other things. Uh, most of these musicians here, including myself, has studied uh, when we were children. So please donate um, any costumes, any volunteer work, or any money, anything that you can to the Grace Theatre Workshop. It would be greatly appreciated. I'd also like to thank Peter Dubo, uh, director and his sound crew, for helping us out tonight, and Mauro DiTrizio of Action Productions for videotaping. Uh, so for my distinguished musicians, I'd like to introduce first Mr. Kevin Brown on bass. He's considered uh, one of the best double bass players in New York City in the metropolitan area. He's active in jazz theater and as an orchestral freelance artist uh, in our area for about 15 years. He is a member of the string faculty at Montclair State University. He's the principal bass player of the orchestra of St. Peter by the Sea, and he's performed with Marvin Hamlish, Rich Little, Regis Philbin, uh, the Drifters, and a multitude of other great performers. On keys, my second guest is Mr. Alan Rosenthal from Brooklyn, who studied jazz as a child as well. He's a distinguished musician, writer, composer, arranger. He composed for the Paul, da Paul Taylor Dance Company and was staff music arranger for Warner Brothers Publications for many years. He's the author of many articles on jazz and classical music, uh, especially for the New York Times. He performed with Clark Terry, Fantasia, Carrie Jackson, to mention a few. Uh, he performs all the time at the prestigious jazz clubs in New York City, uh, especially the Village Gate, Cleopatra's Needle, Birdland, the historic Central Park Boathouse, to name a few. He also composed the movement Sonata Sonata. He's the guy to go to for any classical or jazz information. On drums uh, is Steve Johns from Englewood. He's originally from Boston. He also played drums since the age of nine. He grew up in a jazz home. His mother was Goldie Tyler Johns, who was a songwriter, and his three uncles were jazz musicians, so how could he miss, right? He studied at the New England uh, Conservatory of Music. He moved to New York City in 1982, and he is also now an adjunct instructor at Montclair State University. He's got an incredible schedule. I'm very happy that he could show up tonight and do this performance despite the rain and everything else. He's played with uh, Wynton Marsalis, Diane Shore, the Count Basie Orchestra, all the Brecker brothers, Randy Brecker, Michael Brecker, Grover Washington, the Vanguard Orchestra, Billy Taylor, Tom Chapin, you name it. So I'm going to leave it to Alan to take the band away and if you feel like dancing, please dance. Thank you.
Thank you very much. I would like to thank my band, Steve Joms on drums, Kevin Brown on bass, and Alan Rosenthal on keys. I'm very grateful that they came tonight to Union City to perform. If you were to hear these men in New York City at a, a leading jazz club, it would be quite a, de quite a bit of money. And I'm very grateful that Union City is providing these kinds of shows for everyone, especially the, uh, the children in the high schools can see this after we videotape. So again, I would like to thank Mayor Brian Stack, Lucio Fernandez, the Commissioner of Public Events, and especially Megan Fernandez, who runs the Grace Theater Workshop. Thank you all for coming out tonight. Thank you very much.